astonishing attack came amidst the fallout of the tournament's most politically charged game yet. Serbia lost their Group E clash with Switzerland 2-1 in Kaliningrad last Friday after Stoke star and Liverpool target certain Shakarar scored a last-minute breakaway winner. Shakiri and Switzerland's other scorer Arsenal star Granit Saka both traced their roots to Kosovo which fought a bloody 16-month war with Serbia over independence in 1998. They celebrated their goals by making a double eagle gesture with their hands to represent the Albanian flag. Many people in Kosovo, which has an ethnic Albanian majority, identify with the flag. Both players are facing a FIFA probe and sanctions, but Kristajic could be in bigger trouble. The Serb coach was raging that Bridge failed to award a penalty in the 66th minute after Newcastle's Alexander Mitrovic was wrestled to the ground in the penalty area by Swiss defenders Stefan Lichtsteiner and Fabian Shire. That's left Serbia needing a result against Brazil in their final game. Blasted Kristajic, we were robbed. I wouldn't give the referee either a yellow or red card, I would send him to The Hague. Then they could put him on trial, like they did to us. And on his Instagram page Kristajic continued his rant posting pictures of the game with the words, Unfortunately, it seems that only Serbs are condemned to selective pursuitus, once it was The Hague and today in football it is bar. FIFA take a dim view of political affiliations of their tournaments. Meanwhile, the Serbian press called Shakiri's celebration shameful provocation, while the midfielder claimed it was just emotion. The Serbian FAAR understood to have also complained to FIFA about the Kosovo flag that adorned one of Shakiri's boots, 